Hey guys, so today I'm going to be showing you how to make this super cute milk and cookies charm. So the milk is actually a slime that you can play with. It's super duper fun. And of course the cookie is a squishy. So let's get started. First, let's begin with the bottle of milk. You will need white Elmer's glue, baking soda, shampoo, or you can also use soap, eye drops, a mini glass bottle, I got mine in a craft store, a container to mix in, and finally something to mix with. First, you're going to pour your glue into your container. I don't have a specific amount of glue you want to pour in, but just kind of eyeball it. I recommend pouring more than you need just because you want enough slime to fit in your bottle. Now we're going to add in some baking soda. Again, you don't have to be exact, I just added a fourth a teaspoon. And now just incorporate that into the glue. Next, you're going to add in your shampoo or soap. I forgot to mention this earlier, but make sure that your shampoo or soap is either white or clear in color because you want to keep the slime white so that it resembles milk. Now you can add in your eye drops and that is what's going to turn your mixture into a slime. So just mix that together and you can see that it will start firming up. So I'm going to add more and I'm just going to keep mixing. And I just touched it to check the consistency and it's a bit sticky so I just added more eye drops. Here I just touched again and it's not as sticky so I'm going to go ahead and grab the slime out of the container. And I just kind of played with it a little to make it less sticky. This part is actually very fun in my opinion. So here are the end results and as you can see it is very very stretchy and super super fun to play with. I am going to go ahead and fill the slime inside the bottle to make it look like a bottle of milk. So to fit the slime into the bottle, I just placed a piece of slime onto the bottle and I used a toothpick to kind of like push the slime into the bottle. So once you're done, you'll see scraps of slime sticking to the rim of the bottle. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to grab a tiny piece of slime and just clean that off. And for a final touch, I am going to stick on a label that says milk on it. Of course, this is optional, but I just think that it looks super cute like that. So now your super cute bottle of milk slime is complete. It's super super cute and it is so fun to play with. Of course, you can always take out the slime to play with. And when you're done, you can just put it back into your bottle. So now let's make our cookie. You will need two circular makeup sponges, yellow, brown, and white puffy paint, some glue, scissors, and toothpicks. First, you're going to glue together your circular makeup sponges. And after the glue dries, I'm going to start shaping the cookie. So the side of the cookie should kind of look like this. And here's how mine turned out after all the shaping. Mix together yellow, white, and brown puffy paint to get this kind of tan color like this. And now you can just start covering your cookie in the color. This is how the cookie looks like after two coats of paint. Now with some brown puffy paint, I'm going to draw on the chocolate chips. So 
So this is how the finished cookie looks like. It's so, so, so cute and it's also very squishy. So now we're going to attach them together to make it a charm. First, you will of course need the milk and cookie, super glue, a ball chain, it does not have to be long like mine, and two eye pins. This is very simple. First, I'm going to cover the eye pin with some super glue and just insert it in the cookie. And now I'm going to do the same for the milk, of course. So now just string the two together with a ball chain. I chose to use a long ball chain because I just thought it looks really cute like that. So now your super cute milk and cookies charm is complete. I think it's perfect for those of you who likes both slime and squishies. And of course you can give one of the items to your best friend to kind of act like a friendship thing, you know? So I hope you guys enjoyed watching this tutorial and if you make this, please be sure to share with me through YouTube or Instagram and I'll be more than happy to see your creations and I'll see you guys next time. Bye!